so there's only one that sucks ah but welcome back or welcome if you're new here my name is caricia today i'm gonna be doing a fall winter thrift haul i have a couple of good pickups here and i just want to share them with you guys because i'm sure you want to see right or else you wouldn't have clicked on this video i'm not gonna make this outro i mean intro super long so Yeah, let's just get into it. Just gonna pull these items out pretty quickly because I have to go outside to do some more thrifting for my business. I'll show you guys what I got in a vlog because I do those if you're new here. If you like this type of video, thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Let's start with this item because it's already out. I've been wearing it the most out of like every single item that I've got here. That is this black cropped cardigan it is a size small from banana republic i had no idea that this was cropped when i picked it up i just thought it was size small and a black cardigan i'm like i have a bunch of black cardigans for reselling but i don't really have any for myself so i was like okay i need a black cardigan and i picked this up by the way i bought all these items at goodwill bin so you know it's purchased i mean it's paid by the pound so these probably cost like I don't know, maybe less than a dollar in most of them. I didn't even know it was cropped until I got home and tried it on. And I was like, oh my god, this is so freaking cute. It also has these like splits at the like sides, like right here. Of course, it's long sleeves. I've been using this a lot, like for a little added extra layer of warmth. When I go out, this would also be so good if I wanted to wear it as like um a top. I mean, if you watched my last thrift haul, you'll know that I bought this black cardigan to crop and wear at the top. I haven't done that yet. Will it ever get DIY? wide? We'll see. <laughs> I don't feel like this isn't all the stuff. I feel like I missed something here. Um, okay, cool. So next stuff, another cardigan. It's just this like, oh, okay, let's try on haul. It's just this like shrug cardigan from Benetton, I think it's called. You know, it's colors of Benetton and it's, I don't think it's wool, but it has this like wool look to it. Yeah, it has a little bit of mole hair, but it's mostly acrylic. It's just this like very cozy little cardigan shrug type sweater. It's also cropped. So that's just like really cute. I love this so much. Like it kind of goes with this dress that I'm wearing right now, but I'm wearing a black trench coat over this dress. So I don't think it's going to look the cutest with this, but this is definitely some inspo. I'm thinking I'll probably wear this, besides this now that I see it, I'll probably wear this with like some jeans and just like a top. Also bought this skirt that I'll show you next. Also, the sleeves on this are extremely long, so I think that's very, very cute. I've been getting a lot of um, outfit inspo from this like, I think it's a game or something, but I've been seeing it on Instagram a lot. And it's called Ever Skies or Ever Skies, something like that. If you know it, tell me in the comments or if you play that game or whatever it is. I don't really know what it is, but it just gives me an outfit from that game in spell. This is so cute. I freaking love this. And I feel like the length is so perfect. Like it's perfectly cropped. I did not pick this up thinking it was going to be so cute. I just bought this brand to sell before and I picked it up. It's a little bit itchy though. It's a little itchy, but it's so so freaking cute like this is like great for literally everything and just adding a little bit of extra warmth whenever i need it really really cute i really really like this one that one's really nice next i have a skirt um i feel like this is a lot less stuff here than i picked up the rest of stuff anyway next up i got this midi skirt ribbed knit midi skirt it's very thick knit and i've been wearing a lot of like longer skirts lately so i think this will be perfect it has these two pockets on the front i believe but i'm pretty sure i'm gonna wear this on the in the back i thought about it and i think that would be extremely cute in the back but i feel like no one would see it um but i also have that like beige crop jacket that i'm actually I haven't showed on this channel but you see it on my instagram i have got this beige crop jacket from Shein. Sorry if you don't believe in fast fashion. It's cheaper than thrift stores sometimes. So, and sometimes I want specific things. Sorry if that hurts your heart, but 
not everyone is gonna do that i'm sorry like i hate when people just like try to come at people for like shopping fast fashion like you don't know some of the situation matter of fact i'm literally put up like this fucking quote that i seen on a book that you don't know what someone's financial situation is or financial mindset is so you just cannot really judge you should just leave people alone because <laughs> honestly i just feel like i should say that hopefully someone will listen because like yes yeah, save the planet but also people gotta live like until better is available for right now that's just what it is so got this i might wear it with that crop jacket um and i'm not really sure otherwise it has some pilling but i don't know it might not bother me i also went to um salvation army one of these days and they were having this 50 percent off sale and well i thought they were having a 50 percent off sale so i picked up like a bunch of items to get 50 percent off of like them but it turns out the 50 percent sale was until the next day so i had to end up putting some items back and one of the items was actually very similar to this it was just like a knit ribbed mini skirt same color and everything and i just decided i'd put it back and probably pick up pick it up from probably somewhere else yeah i was not about to pay full price when i could get it for 50 percent off the next day and i wouldn't know if it would be there the next day so yeah i just like left it anyway this one is zara knit and i just think this will be a cute little staple for the winter time i've been wearing skirts a lot lately i don't know why i've just been in the mood for wearing like skirts so much lately so that's just what I've been doing. So next up, I got some jackets. The first one is this little red kind of like trench coat. I honestly don't really like the buttons, but I probably won't wear it buttoned up anyway. Like if anything, I'll probably just like wrap it tight and then close it up with the belt. And I wouldn't wear this on a colder day anyway. So I mean, if need be, surely I'll close it up, but I don't think, like, I didn't pick it up with the intent of wearing it closed. Maybe, you know, I'll probably end up putting on an outfit and then closing it and be like, oh, it looks cute with this outfit like this, and then getting into it. But yeah, right now I'm just not really feeling it. I'm not feeling the buttons. Um, but overall, the color I think is very, very nice. I have a L.O. Bean trench coat in there in my closet for selling and it's the same color as this but it's longer it's so beautiful and i always want to wear it but it's a size large so literally it would fit me like a house i haven't gotten a chance i haven't gotten to wear it but i'm like so obsessed with it i always look at it and like oh my gosh i wish this was my size or closer to my size um but it's not so i'm really happy that i got this i think it's really really cute this color is mad nice um the pockets are nice and deep oh it has oh it's like a cuff belt i mean like the your cuff of the jacket that's cute that's so cute i'm gonna wear this so tight Just put it like really tight and then like you guys know what i'm talking about like that looks so weird but we're not gonna talk about it but anyway yeah it's cute it has little flaps here on the front very cute right now the outfit that i have in mind is like i want to wear like high-waisted denim jeans and i want to wear like this halter this red halter top that i have that i also thrifted and this over it with like some red lips i don't wear red lips enough and i want to start um so that's what i have in mind it's just like a cute casual look i'm definitely sure i'll like come up with more looks actually i just came up with another one with outfit that i was going to wear today it's just like an all gray outfit and this i might just have to change i'm just kidding i might just even wear it like that it was like a gray turtleneck gray little mini skirt boot and this jacket these looks they just they just be coming to me <laughs> but yeah that'd be really cute and this one is New York and Company. But overall, the color of this is just so fire. So freaking nice. I'm excited about the cup. But there's only one. There's only one. That sucks. I just found it in the pocket. The other pocket is empty. Ah, oh, but that would've been cute though. Might get some strength <laughs> and carry out that look nonetheless. Cause that would be really cute. 
So next up, also I got another jacket. This one is orange. I feel like I just got some colored jackets because I feel like, I don't know, I wear a lot of neutral colors and I'd be like trying to like find a little bit more color, especially when I'm taking like Instagram pictures. I'd be wanting to like, I feel like Instagram really like hones in on my style, like what I do too often and what I want to change. So like, I just wear a lot of neutral colors like so much so i feel like i need some more pops of color especially like in jackets i feel like it would be a good place to add that pop of color because you know jacket or jackets and coats are like a big part of an outfit so yeah i just really want to get some more colors like neutrals are great because you can put them with anything but also colors kind of like get you at your comfort zone and kind of like pushes you to be a little bit more creative with your outfits so i definitely been trying to like get more color the next one is kind of this like this orangey it's kind of brown but it's like also kind of like orange like it's a very dark orange brown i don't know what you call this type of jacket actually but it gives me very vintage vibes and it's really like cozy i feel like this would actually be good in the winter as well and i really like that it's this like big size like it's very large and oversized like i just really like the color i love this like vintage look i love the collar i feel like this would look good with like turtlenecks and you can because it's so big you can like really you can really like layer things underneath it and it's kind of like puffer so it's like i really feel like it's gonna be like a very warm cozy jacket and it says microfiber whatever that means and this one is from liz caliborn um it's extra large but i just feel like it would be a good oh it has a oh yes because i bought this like leather coat to sell you guys can kind of see the orangeness can you I bought this like leather coat to sell and literally had it on yesterday and was looking to see if it had like an inner pocket even though the pockets are so big i was looking if it had like an inner pocket but it does not so this is good that this one has a leather pocket and it has like the little logo on the neckline underneath the collar i think that's kind of cute too actually i don't know if anyone would agree with me but i think that's actually kind of cute having the logo right there so yeah this is really cute i feel like this is gonna be really warm and just add a little something to you know regular outfits like this one unlike the red one that i wore bought mostly just for looks at this point in time this one i feel like is definitely gonna be like a staple that i wear all of the time like literally um in my last haul i got that black pleated i mean not pleated the black quilt jacket like i wear that jacket so often it's like a staple so i feel like this is gonna be a staple as well i could actually wear that jacket today it's like 60 degrees so to go with this orange coat i bought this bag again adding some color i felt i felt like this would be really cute um to go with this orange and brighten it up a little bit as well cute little i think it's called a baguette bag i think it'd be good wear like this or even over shoulder like that like i feel like that's so freaking cute and it's just and it's also like a really good size i feel like i need more cute like fashionable bags that are like a good size all my good size the bags they're literally all crochet bags so like i'm like i wear anything with anything sometimes but like you know it's not much variation since they're all like the same texture so all of my like good size bag are all bags are all crochet so i felt like this was really nice because this one isn't crochet and it's giving like cargo streetwear type vibes um throwback type type vibes where the crochet bags really give me more summer vibes even though i'd be wearing them anyway but i love this so freaking much so much i love the color um this person i don't know if it came with this but, it, but they seem to have put this like paper clip on the end of the bag and i'm literally gonna leave that there because i think it adds such a cute little extra detail like i don't think it came like that i think they literally just 
put a paper clip on it and it looks really cute there so i'm gonna keep it there these extra pockets for extra storage like this is a good sized bag and has a lot of like storage in here like this bag is very practical and you can wear it in like a very bohemian indie style or streetwear fashion like you know it's versatile so that's mad cute i really like this one this is my most like colorful bag that i have so i'm really excited about it and especially because it's fall right now and it's been like such a pretty fall as well like i don't know if anyone feels like this but i feel like this fall has been like extra pretty outside so hoping to get some cute content pictures outside with this bag while it's still like still leaves on the ground and stuff really like this one next the only thing that i went to google bins to get that day was literally a pair some shoes so you guys know how um what are they called oh, i forgot what they're called now loafers loafers are in style so i just kind of want to get some loaf loafers for just to like honestly these leather loafers have never been really my style but because they're so trending right now i kind of wanted to just try some outfits with it um so i got a really really nice pair actually found a really nice pair i'm surprised that i even found any because i felt like i might have not found any because it's such a popular item right now that people would be looking for it but i found a really nice pair and i found them in my size perfectly in my size too so i'm really happy about that the next items that i got were shoes the next two items were shoes because honestly throughout my life it doesn't even matter how many pairs of shoes i have i tend to really stick to one pair of shoes and but the thing is with instagram like i don't know i just feel like i'm being so repetitive so yeah these are the loafers that i got they have this like little heel here i think it's i think the heel is actually so freaking adorable and like classic like i just i'm just like in love with the fact that they have this like little heel i don't even think i noticed how high it was when i picked it up but i think these are so freaking cute but yeah it's just these like little tiny like loafers they're giving like school vibes they're also very 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 much in good condition it looks like the person whoever had these wore them like two or three times like not often at all these are zara um i have no idea how much these would cost in store but they fit me perfectly they're size 38 and they just fit freaking perfectly let me see they're actually like really heavy so i don't think they're real leather but they're like pretty weighty shoes um and yeah i'm just gonna really be playing with these yesterday i went out to donate some items at a buy sell trade store and i did the dumbest thing that i also vlogged about go watch my vlogs if you haven't i mean or subscribe so you can watch that vlog when it's up because that one won't be up when this goes up but subscribe and be here for when it's up i went to a buy sell trade store i went to buffalo exchange i've only been to buffalo chain exchange like once or something and yeah they're like really expensive there like for a thrift store it's like yeah no the fuck and i don't even like the stuff that they have there that much so but i went there to sell some stuff and then i was gonna donate the rest to goodwill besides the point i went there i had everything my purse and everything in one huge tote bag everything i wanted to donate my purse i was gonna go take content so i had my tripod and the mount and a little like tripod bag as well all of that was inside the tote bag and tell me why i gave her the entire bag and i remember to take my purse out of course but then i forgot my tripod and the mount inside the bag and i didn't remember until i got to where i was going to take content and realized oh my gosh i left my tripod in the donation bag like what I call them because i was gonna go back to the store but i was like let me just call them and see if they are if they could find it before i even get there and then i or i get there and they tell me oh you can't take back donations or something dumb or that they can't find it which is more 
understandable if they can find it like what can you do they told me that a donation company already picked up the donations so <sighs> tell me why i left my tripod mount i donated my tripod and the mount i literally had to order a new one it's coming today maybe it's already here i don't even know but guys like are you kidding me nonetheless what got me to that story is because today i was actually thinking about taking content in these and the outfit that i was gonna wear which is what i the whole point of the story was i was gonna wear like this l bean um knit yellow jumpsuit that i've had for the longest time to sell it's so freaking cute um and i'll show a little cute over this dress also it'd be really cute with this dress maybe with some boots these outfits man just come to me today and you write this down <laughs> somebody wrote this stuff down but yeah i was thinking that l bean crew neck l bean yellow knit sweater a black skirt black tights white like little not ankle length but just like a little bit above ankle length socks and these shoes cute little schoolgirl outfit i like hers i'm really happy with this fine i'm so surprised with my luck that i went there and i actually found a really good pair like they're giving pilgrim steppers i got my pilgrim steppers and i'm very happy with them <laughs> next lastly i got some boots to think i didn't think this was a lot of stuff i feel like i've, I've been recording forever nextly i got some boots I am like obsessed with these boots that I'm wearing. I bought these boots and I've been obsessed with them. I'm wearing them every single day. I'm wearing them with every single outfit and I'm obsessed. But again, needing a little diversity and literally if it wasn't for Instagram, I would just maybe would just live my life wearing these boots. So I also wanted to get some more boots. Um, So I got these little chelsea boots i haven't worn chelsea boots in so long they're like giving chunky platform boots they're like they look really big but i but they're size six wait they're size six i'm size seven they look freaking massive i'm pretty sure i tried them on and they fit but they look humongous like seriously like i don't know if they're too chunky then i'll probably just like resort to wearing them with like underneath pants but i think they'll be fine honestly like you you can wear it i could wear a chunky boot and give like a chunky look it's not a big deal so got this little chelsea boot it's a little crunched i mean i could probably put like paper in here but honestly it's not that big of a deal to me this is that i'm trying to touch the bottom but even this one it looks very like looks hardly worn so that's really great like literally, look at that. It looks like they never wore this. Probably because it's like so freaking big for a size six, especially. Um, because I thought this was a size seven and it looked big, so I don't know what brand this is. I think it's like what brand is this? Oh yeah, it's ASOS. Um, ASOS size six chunky boot, really cute. That is my thrift haul, my little fall winter triumph thrift haul. That I have this might be the last fall winter the haul that I do and next might just be winter because winter starts like December 20 something and I don't think I'm gonna go thrifting again before then my last fall winter thrift haul everything from here on out will be winter but you know I have my stuff that I can wear all seasons around so yeah that's that for this haul thanks for watching if you liked any of these items tell me what your favorite item was below be sure to thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you like these types of hauls again don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more from me and more thrift hauls tell me below if you want to see more thrift hauls thinking of doing just like bear vlogs and just hauls on this channel actually no i'm lying um but anyway thanks for watching <laughs> i'll see you in my next video hope you enjoyed this one let me know if you did by thumbsing thumbsing up thumbsing up by thumbing up thumbsing you know what i mean thanks for watching guys bye love you giving all the girlies kisses now i can go out and go do more shifting
Yay. Ha.